All right, hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the Testing Academy. In this video, I'm gonna talk about how to become a high paying software tester. I'm gonna talk, start with my failure, right? And I will start with like how I got rejected with almost 27 plus companies, right? I had applied for a role of tech support, SEO, developer role, a backend role, even the digital marketing, right? And how still I was able to get into the IT, how I was able to improve. In this video, I'm going to talk about three important secrets. If I can do it, if I am from a known IT background as a fresher, was able to switch and get into the automation testing with coding and I'm doing amazing, like how you can do it too and how you can also get a high salary and better opportunities as compared to other people, right? Let me tell you a very important story right before we start so me and many of my friends started with same engineering background we have started with same mncs now many of my friends are still almost are you know half of the package which basically right now i'm getting but see i'm not bragging about service but i wanted to give you a motivation and a process which you can do it too so that you can become a high paying software tester and that is possible even in india all right let's get started with this let me tell you a very important thing so when i have started right after finishing the engineering there was no job to be honest there was no job i didn't go and get any job after all i basically went to a uh, bangalore where a uh, nearby silk board right it's uh, one of the busiest road in the bangalore right uh, we had uh, we call it bangalore at the time right so there i used to sleep on a dome beds right i used to share a room right i went there i was searching for a job right in that during that time almost it took me around six to seven months to search a proper job right i have applied for tech tech support role developer role backend role even applied for digital marketing role and search engine optimization i used to work for that role right i have applied for it right still got rejected rejected in 27 plus smaller startups plus mncs bigger mncs also i was rejected in cognizant at that time right that was uh, again things see still i got rejected i mean recently also i got rejected in adobe as well as in google that's totally fine but I want to give you this important slide, which is achievement I have created now more than 600 videos on YouTube, become a browser stack champion, postman, supernova, cracked Amazon to one time browser stack, wingify, take on multiple times, almost like 5.5 million views have taught more than 5,000 plus students for automation as well as mobile testing in API testing achievement. Many of the testimonials you can see on the love.testingacademy.com how I was able to do it, right? Let's discuss in the three secrets, how you can do it too. All right, secret number one, which is switching at the right time. Guys, this is very, very important. What happens is you join a particular company, especially I have seen my friends have made the same mistake, which is they were basically into the MNCs or a service based company for a longer duration of a time, right? So when we have joined, I switched to a product based company after one and a half year of experience after getting uh, enough good knowledge. I generally recommend also if you are a fresher, join a service based company because uh, you will get to know about the process but immediately switch to the product based company they will give you a better salary and better opportunities right this is what i have seen uh, my average for new companies is almost like two years see it doesn't matter sometimes people say no promote you don't have to be switch you are a jumper nothing works guys many times i have discussed this also in one of the survey also it was done that if you want to increase your salary right switching at the right moment is very very important if you are not switching if you are going with the same company right suppose this person is going it's in a same company is uh, he's not switching at all this person is switching at a right moment right definitely you will see a higher package for this one this person will climb the ladder fast as compared to that so initial days no pain no gain i mean it initial days is all about giving your more than 100 percent that was i have done i joined a startups where i have learned about many many things i learned about marketing qa support role even development i used to write the unit test case, case, cases when i was in startup you now you can imagine so switching at the right time and giving your 100 percent when you have joined uh, for three to four years is very very important if you want to get a higher salary in that case right that's the secret number one let's jump to secret number two i have never stopped learning guys when i was from an ec background then i have learned about manual testing then i have learned about api testing then i moved to an automation then i have learned about devops then i learned about the qa lead things then i learned about the soft skill related to the leadership management then i have learned about the scrum related things then i have learned about the qa architect things which are now scalability and how to manage metrics and other things right so i'm still 
you're learning gain your experience quickly this is one of the important things do try out do fail right i have joined couple of companies which are not great i have a learning there right i had experience of bad managers also right i had learning there but again i have switched to a better word that is what important i have learned so many things i have worked on front end back end qa support role multiple times for small small things you know I have worked on Kafka backend related uh, things spring boots many things I have worked on when I was working in many many startups this was one of the learning so product based companies startups right mostly they will give you a leverage that you can work for some time on some other technologies also this is where your learning curve will increase so I thought why I am learning this right this will not be helpful but all this were helpful when you have joined a next company where these kind of things you will get to implement right that's the su super important thing the secret number 3 which is network with the people guys this is very very important right i have told multiple times you have to network with the people this is the only way how you can increase your salary because the more you will network with the people you will go, you will get to know about the companies see directly company will not tell you uh, about their self their work culture right for example when i was searching for a good company in new delhi right i got to know about the wingify wingify is one of the good company because i have a network with where one of my friend was working i used to connect with him he said okay this it's a good company we have a work life balance amazing we are using latest technologies we are working on these this this tech and i was very intriguing to join that company right so network 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 that's the important thing that's the secret number 3 that you have to do right another important point is that whatever that you are learning you have to share see i have started my scroll test blog uh, in 2014 right around 2014 and 15 i have started my domain and i started blogging this is where the youtube channel started and after that you got to know that almost 1 lakh subscriber now so you have to share if you can share on blog that's fine if you can share on medium.com that's fine if you can share on linkedin post that is fine share your knowledge that's a super important thing right uh, everyone knew from the third company because see nowadays if you know right many companies already knew about me because i have all, almost like 1 lakh subscriber so many where whenever I join a company right they most of the hrs know about me how i have done it is because of the networking that's the important point few bonus point i think specializing is very very important when i have started i have specialized in mobile testing then i have specialized in web automation right that's a super important thing you have to do you have to stay up to date with the technology see when playwright was introduced we immediately added the automation framework and we have started using it so you have to update yourself and we you have to be proactive that's a super important thing build a strong resume you have to crack the code of negotiation salary as well as resume to get a amazing tool right many time i had a very heated argument with hrs because hr said okay uh, this is we cannot go beyond our budget this is very high promote you are uh, whatever that you are asking right we cannot go ahead but again i have convinced them because of my proactiveness specialization strong resume negotiation and recommendations right this is what i have done and the three secrets which are i have a knowledge i can provide value i have a past records that you can showcase this is what we have done right so i hope this makes sense i hope this inspired you all about like how you can also become a high paying software tester in future this is the video that i have basically showcased this video conclusion in for this video is that guys if i can do it you can do it too yes you can become a high pa high paying software tester it's all about how you are if you are switching at a right moment you are going to a better company and you are doing uh, what they required you provide a value which is amazing right this is the you have to give your 110% that's the important thing network with the people and fake it till you make it that's the important thing learning out and thanks for joining if you are existing subscriber thanks for joining and if you are a new one do consider subscribe i create videos around software testing development and programming i'll see you in the next video thanks a lot bye bye